चैप्टर नाइन प्रोग्रामिंग कॉन्सेप्ट विथ स्क्रैच इंट्रोडक्शन इन द प्रीवियस क्लास वी लर्न अबाउट बेसिक फीचर्स ऑफ स्क्रैच स्क्रैच इज डेवलप्ड बाय मैसुचेसेट्स इंस्टीट्यूट ऑफ टेक्नोलॉजी एम आई टी केम्ब्रिज यूएसए स्क्रैच इज अ विजुअल टूल विच चिल्ड्रन कैन यूज टू लर्न प्रोग्रामिंग इन एन एक्साइटिंग वे In this chapter we shall explore the basics of event handling and decision making with examples. Quick recap. Let's have a quick review of the features of Scratch we have learned earlier. Launching Scratch. Open start menu and click on Scratch option. Scratch project window. Every animation in Scratch is treated as a separate project. Scratch interface shows the project window. Project window is composed of following main parts. Stage shows the position and placing of sprites in your animation. It also shows the output of the animation created by you. Sprites palette lists all the sprites added by you in your animation. Sprites are various objects that together make your animation. Blocks palette contains all the building blocks of your animation. Adding sprites above the sprites palette, click on sprites from library icon. Sprites library will be displayed where sprites are organized in various categories. Double click on the desired sprite to add it to the stage. Exercise: Landing a plane. From transport category in sprite library add airplane sprite to the stage click on shrink tool on the toolbar above the stage click on the airplane sprite a few times to shrink it to a smaller size go to the scripts tab in blocks palette and add the following blocks from events and motion category as shown here to run the animation click on above the stage explanation the glide block has two settings duration in seconds and destination to glide the sprite to in terms of x y coordinates the center of the stage is at x is 0 and y is 0 moving from left to right increases coordinate x and moving upwards increases coordinate y we have already kept the airplane at top left that is extreme negative x coordinate and positive y coordinate x is equal to 100 y is equal to minus 100 is down at bottom right diagonally opposite to initial position of the plane we have set the gliding time to 1 second This glides the airplane slowly from top left corner of the stage down to bottom right corner that looks like airplane is landing changing sprite costume add the which sprite from the sprite library in blocks palette go to costume tab costume editor will open up the editing toolbar provides basic drawing and coloring tools to change the appearance of the sprite event handling an event is any action occurring at any point of time before after or during animation for example user clicks on stage a key is pressed on the keyboard etc Scratch lets us decide what to do when an event occurs. For example, if user clicks anywhere on the stage or on a sprite, we can let the sprite do something. The basic approach towards event handling is to identify the correct event block and a logical sequence of actions to be performed. Exercise: Mouse click and space key. Add sprite Amun from People category in Sprites library. Using tool at the top of the stage, decrease Amun's size. Place Amun at bottom right corner of the stage as shown here. 
from scripts tab go to events category add when this sprite clicked block to your script from script tab go to motion category add glide to block with the values for seconds x and y as shown here from scripts tab events category add when space key is pressed block to your script from script tab control category add stop all block explanation on the event when this sprite clicked when user clicks on amon it would glide towards right side on the event when space key pressed amon would stop exercise arrow keys moving a ball around following script captures the key press events of right left up and down arrow keys to move a ball sprite explanation the basic fundamental in moving the ball around is to change its direction for each arrow key press and then moving it a few steps in the corresponding direction this is achieved by point in direction block from motion category this block turns the sprite in following four directions 0 upward 180 downward 90 towards right side minus 90 towards left side reverse of 90 these four directions have been mapped to right left up and down arrow keys respectively and then sprite ball is moved 10 steps introduction to taking decisions to control the flow of animation many times certain checks need to be done and depending on the condition the animation should change checking certain condition and deciding the course of the script is called taking decisions for example we can check the direction of the sprite and if it is not moving in the desired direction we can change it let us have a look at this example exercise sensing color add cat and bananas sprites on the stage as shown here add when space key pressed block from events category add move 10 steps from motion category add if then block from control category drag drop touching color block from sensing category to the condition slot of if then block click once in the color square of touching color block mouse pointer will turn into pointing finger shape now click on the yellow color on the banana sprite this will set the yellow color in the square into if then block add point in direction zero blocks press space bar until the cat reaches the bananas and observe what happens explanation for every space bar press the cat will move forward 10 steps the if then block checks if the cat is touching yellow color this is accomplished by touching color block if the cat touches yellow color bananas anywhere on the stage it will turn in upward zero direction